Hi there, folks. Um, it's time to stream. Um, hang on. Sorry about that. I Sinuses, allergies, my throat sounds weird and rough because I've been coughing a lot again. Because my, it's just, it's a nightmare. Anyway, hi, it's a, it's a crisp, warm, 93 degrees out there today. We're going to play some more Sonic Origins. Last time we were, um, we just started Sonic CD. I think we were in AF. Collision Chaos. Caught the VOD of your last stream. Glad to catch this one live. Yep. And I am very interested in getting through this quickly because I want to do a video on Sonic Origins and I won't do that until I finish the game. So it is kind of imperative that we finish the game or games uh, as quickly as possible. Um, cause a lot of people seem to be having problems with this game and a lot of them, I don't know what I played of Sonic one last stream wasn't so bad. I thought it was all right. So far I am happy with Sonic origins. But we also haven't gotten to Sonic 3 yet, which is possibly where a lot of the problems lie. And this just started me in the past? Did we time travel to the past last time we played? I guess we must have. That's kind of a, a sneaky trick, though, if you're looking for robot generators. I don't think they hide them right there. I don't remember where the robot generator is in this level. I know it's up. It's up on like one of these. That just takes me back to the start. But yeah, I am itching to play more of this and see if I find any problems because there are a lot of videos going around out there of people encountering weird things. A lot of people are complaining about Sonic Origins. I'm curious to see if I'm going to run into anything I don't agree with. Oh, did I mess up coming down here? I think it's up there. Oh, hang on. I forgot. I was going to hit the tweet button and I didn't just to tell people that we were starting now. That's right. There it is. Said, I haven't bought it yet as it's a pricey son B. Okay, so there was the robot generator. So, okay, now it's coming back to me, what we did on Thursday. I remember time traveling here. So, you're meaning to tell me... Said, by the way, on the stick around screen ATM. Still? Oh. I must have tapped the wrong button. Thank you for telling me. Uh, I guess while we were on the waiting screen, I got the robot generator. Which was animated AF said right here. Only since you tweeted. Right. It's right here. And what I was trying to say is that I remember we ended the stream last time. I remember time traveling here. So that's probably how we ended up in the past. I think I ended up going forward here looking for the robot generator and it was right there. So that's on me. You know what? Let's go to the future. Like I was saying last stream, you barely get to see the good futures. But maybe oh, that's not good. See, now we have to go to the good futures, because I need rings. 
future. If I remember right, good futures are a great place to stock up on rings. Because I am one of these psychopaths that likes to do... Saturn Thew Zero LF said, can never have too many rings. Hmm. Yeah. I'm one of those psychopaths that likes to both get the robot generators and do the time stones. Also, I just like this good future jam. It's pretty good. Now, do you guys fire? Okay, you don't. Like, how could you hate the North American soundtrack with songs like this on it? Animated AF. Said, I think I have never seen good futures in Act 1 or 2 as just 3 for obvious reasons. Yep. I mean, you almost never have a reason to go to a good future. It's one of those things where you kind of have to go out of your way to see it. further back to get more rings, but I don't know if it's going to let me. Sonic CD is also one of those games that does not like you backtracking too much, even though, like, it's half the point of the gameplay. Okay, we're nine rings short. Yeah, like right here. This is a one-way street. I can't go down there anymore. Go up here. Oh, but I can go through there. Great. Oh, I, I don't have a charge anymore. That's good. Oh. Yes. Five more rings. Mind the spikes. Ooh, do I go for it? I mean, I kind of have to go this way anyway. Animated AF said, U.S. Austin's great too. I'm biased for the one I grew up with, though. Exactly. something else I forgot to do. Normally I like to put chat up on the TV next to me and I forgot to do that. Animated AF said helps the Japan one is so UK dance scene like too. Mm-hmm. Seem to remember I've had trouble with this one in the past. I get out of the water. I really shouldn't be looking over at my TV at times like this. But it made a sound. Oh, come on! I hate the collision detection in these so much. Okay, slow down. There we go. One more. Slow down. Oh, son of a bitch. Sort of like with air bubbles, the moment you hear that sound, you should run and go pick up a time extension. Don't screw around. 
Saturn Thu Zero LF, said, I always thought the jump, spin dash sound effect sounded really weird in CD. Yeah, it does. I mean, it's, it's cool, but it does, it's different. How do I get to my bookmarks? Okay, I should be getting Twitch chat up on the TV here any second now. Where's Amy Rose? All right, because I was in the past. We don't see her. I'm doing this on purpose. Whoa! I love the sound those make, though. We were in such a hurry today, I didn't get to ask, how's audio? Do I sound audible enough? Do I sound echoey at all? Is the game audio loud enough? Saturn Thu Zero LF said, sounds fine to me. Good. Animated AF said, sounds great. Oh, where even is the robot generator in this one? Like, I had some idea in the last one, but I have no idea here. Yeah, I saw it. <laughs> Animated AF said, I love how the bad mix are sometimes a bit broken, missing parts, etc. Yeah, I know. It kind of lends to like the time travel angle angle where, you know, some of them are older than others. And the implication is, is supposed to be that I guess the more broken ones are older. I almost wonder if there's like a correlation where you can go like to the past here, find a badnik, travel forward to the future, and if the same badnik is in the same place but he's a little more broken down now, that might be pretty cool. The longest time I remember thinking the robot generator, like seeing this now, I remember thinking it was like up here somewhere, but obviously it wasn't. Okay, let's switch the chat on my TV to dark mode, because oh my gosh. I am being blinded by the sun over here. Oh, I love this background. Apparently this background, it was recently discovered um, as a reference to something in like a Japanese Sega magazine. I don't remember the specific context offhand, but um, recently some people have been trying to get like Japanese Sega magazines scanned in, like official Sega magazines. And this island artwork in the background is like an actual painting someone made for that magazine. Animated AF said, I think I saw that something to do with one of their arcades. I think so, yeah. Might have been like a joypolis thing. Saturn Thu Zero LF said, 
thought for years after the Cybershell video that we would never see scans of Harmony until it happened earlier this year. Yep. That was the name of the magazine, I believe. Now that's mean. Sonic CD has a lot of moments like that, and I don't like it. Oh, top five worst boss in all of Classic Sonic, right here. A great idea in practice, a terrible idea in execution. Or a great idea in theory is what I meant to say. Because you just get zero. bounced around so easily. This boss can either take 10 seconds or 10 years depending yeah. on your luck. Yep. You either fire straight up and nail him in one shot, or you get stuck getting bounced around like I am. But I had a person once tell me that Sonic wasn't about pinball physics. And you look at this, this is literally a pinball table. I'm gonna start swearing. Like, badly. Zoom Fondel said, Wow, this is really cool. What if we made an entire game of this? Hey, Sonic Spinball is fine for one level. Toxic Caves is great. And then by the next level, it turns to garbage. If Sonic Spinball had all been levels like Toxic Caves, I would have loved that game so much more. And now comes the level I've told a story about. Where... When Sonic CD 2011 was coming out, or 2010, I, I'm not sure if it was 2011 or 2010, but... I went back and I played the original Sonic CD. On like multiple different platforms. I played it on like PC, emulator, I think I even dug out my Sega Genesis and hooked it up. And every single version of Sonic CD I had played, every single save file, I stopped playing at Tidal Tempest. Because <laughs> I got to this level and I went, nope, screw this, and I turned the game off. Zoom Fondel said, I sure believe it. Oh, I think... I think we're... I think I'm taking a shortcut right now. I think down here is the end of the level. I think my save file on my Mega CD was the same, haha. -ha. I think... I have to go now. Ooh, Sonic CD. You are a very rude video game. Saturn Thew Zero LF said, I remember hearing that CD originally started off as a Sega CD port of Sonic 1. It sure feels like it with its level of themes. Yeah. Though it is so weird that both Sonic 2 and Sonic CD happened on the idea of time travel independently. And then, of course, Sonic 2 ditched the idea of time travel. Because they were planning on making Sonic 2 like a game with like 40 levels, or like 50 levels, or something crazy. They're like, nah, we don't have time for this. And of course, there are Sonic 2 prototypes out there where it just straight up has Green Hill Zone in it from Sonic 1. Robot Generator is right there. Because I remember this thing giving me grief. And I hate these guys. Because <clears throat> they shoot these tiny little bullets that you almost can't see. Okay, so we got to time travel and go in there.
that's right this this is a pain in the butt because there are like no past posts like anywhere I think there's like one in the whole level and it's like up where I just came from out of the water that's right man screw this game <laughs> I remember this now. I remember having trouble with this. Ugh. Saturn Thew Zero LF said, Whoops. I don't think I like Sonic CD very much. Oh, I don't. Like. I talk about going back and replaying the original Sega CD version in 2010 or 2011 or whatever. That was kind of like the moment I realized, hey, wait a minute, I don't think I like this game very much. Said, I am actually going to admit I have zero memories of Tidal Tempest. Not that I played a lot of CD, but I don't think I've ever seen you play this stage. Yeah, because it sucks. Right, okay. Memories are forming. There might be a past post over here somewhere. No, that's the end of the level because there's a special route that comes up through there and then the, the goal thing is that way. Is it down here? No, yeah, no, don't want to do that. We might just have to restart the whole level. KDB underscore Gronola underscore bars said, I would honestly restart right. the stage at this point, lol. Hmm? Did that? Saturn Thew Zero LF said, I think a Sonic game more focused on exploration could be cool, but gosh, not like this. Well, hang on. I think that, that right there is my first mistake. I need to come out here. Because going down to that pipe gets us trapped somewhere, and I don't think that's where we want to go. The panel might be up here somewhere. Or not. Maybe it all just loops around to the same place. Can I grab onto this? Can't. Nothing up there anyway. The underscore Gronola underscore bars said, honestly say what you will about CD, but they managed to give us two separate great soundtracks. Future. KDB underscore Gronola underscore bars said, I very slightly prefer the US soundtrack. I kind of find it fits the levels better. So which one did we go down last time? We went down this one. What if we go down this one? Oh, there it is. Okay. I am not kidding. I think that is literally the only past post is in this entire level. That's... That looks terrible. And this lowers... no. All right. Well, I'm not going down there. Oh, I gotta be careful. Because <laughs> I know exactly where I want to use this pass post. Animated AF said... This zone was riddled with slowdown on the Mega CD. Yep, I remember that. We are also over 50 rings, so I'd really like to hold on to these. Can't touch that. But they put an enemy right in front of it. Probably should have gotten some air. Yeah, because I'm not going to be able to time travel on time. Uh-oh, we're screwed. No, we're not. 
So where's that spring section? We passed it. Did they get rid of the transitional parts in this song too? Or granola underscore bars said, I wish that time travel posts just opened a Stargate like the Sonic 2 special stages. Yeah. It would be so much easier. Uh, I know there is a spring loop section. Where is it? Uh oh. this just gets us trapped in here. Is it up? No, it's right here. Please, no! Winner chicken dinner. <sighs> Zoom Fondil said, this is why you should just wait for Vector Cassette. Okay. First sigh of relief breathed. And now we're basically at the end of the level anyway. There you go. That only took nine minutes. KDV underscore Gronola underscore bars said, Oh, you're doing both side quests? Yup. <laughs> Maybe there's a reason I don't like Sonic CD and it's because I make it unnecessarily hard for myself. <laughs> like I was saying last stream, I always had this idea like, the game itself never said it, but I always thought, instead of just making a good future, that you could make a very good future by doing both. This isn't the last one, is it? It feels like this is the last one. Animated AF said, A good or future. KDV underscore Gronola underscore bars said, see that would be cool, but then they'd need to make more music lol. Bartman 3010 said, they never did fix that background, did they? KDV underscore Gronola underscore Oh yeah, they didn't. Said, this looks like the fifth one to me. And I swear the time refill UFO has better collision detection on it than these ones, on purpose. Like, they specifically make these ones annoying to hit. But then you can almost always hit this one. KDV underscore Gronola underscore bars said. If you're quick, you can pause and restart if you need to. Did they keep that in this one? Ronola underscore bars said, unless they took it out in this version, I've only ever played 2011. I think they took it out of this version because you're supposed to spend coins to replenish your, to retry special stages. Like, if I fail one of these, it'll pop up and say, Do you want to spend one coin to retry the special stage? KDV underscore Gronola underscore bars said, Oh, right, I forgot they added a real way to do it. Yeah. I wonder how you'd get those. I have no idea if I'm supposed to come in here or not.
KDB underscore Granola underscore Bars said, I will never understand why they use the Sega CD tracks for this remake and not the OSP versions. Well, like, that's the thing, right? I think the original 2011 version used, like, the full tracks, like, the ones the way they're supposed to be. Like, with the the transitional middle ground, middle parts and everything. And it sounds like this is just... They... I don't know. It sounds like they took those transi transitional parts out. Animated AF said, Sonic Team on Dumb Things for Reasons. KDB underscore Granola underscore Bars said, The 2011 version isn't the US release, but I'm pretty sure they edited the Sega CD tracks to loop cleanly. KDB yeah, underscore something like that. underscore Bars said, Sounds like that's missing here. Yeah, like it's, it's really weird. And from what I understand, like, the remastered Retro Engine tracks, where they actually tracked down the studio version of the original synthesizer that the Sega Genesis sound chip was based on, they removed those, too, and just replaced them with, like, generic game rips from the Genesis. It's... They, like, actively undid things that made these versions better. Be careful. Is it up here? I feel like I have a memory there. It is. Underscore Granola underscore bars said, Oh, yeah, they also removed all the voice clips from this version. Right. Like, we didn't get to see it, but apparently, even like Amy's Yelp in Collision Chaos, they got rid of. Super weird. I saw you. Boy, I bet the compression doesn't like this. KDB underscore Granola underscore Bars said, Have you caught wind that this version uses Greeware HCA audio like Lost World Forces? So it all but guarantees the changes are the fault of Sonic Team and not the head cannon folks. I've heard that, yeah. But also, why wouldn't you just convert the files that already existed instead of finding new files to replace them with? Like, they went out of their way to change these things. KDB underscore Granola underscore Bars said, out, but then why wouldn't you just keep the original log audio files either? Animated AF said, if it ain't broke, break it. Like, also that too. Underscore bars said, I know that second one is because they're more comfortable with Creeware, but still. But like, even if they're more comfortable with Cryware, like it, it just, it, it doesn't make any sense. Ogvorbis is a freeware format. Anything and everything can play Ogvorbis. Sega has to pay to license Cryware stuff.
Let's pour one out for when in 2011 I got the, the world record time on this by accident. Oh, well, it wasn't world record, but I was top of the leaderboard for like two months. Because I accidentally got a glitch on this boss that let me like spin dash in and hit him right away. It's pretty funny. I think even to this day, I still have like a top 50 time on Xbox Live Arcade. Because something let me just get in there and hit him right when this was happening. So I had a time of like 41 seconds. <laughs> As you can tell, like 41 seconds would have been crazy. Said. How much of a difference does the drop dash make in this game? I'm curious. I mean, some people seem to really like it. I don't think it's making that much of a difference for me. I mean, it's welcome to have it, of course. But I'm so paranoid about not being able to time travel <laughs> that I don't want to just use it willy-nilly wherever I can. Apparently, you can use the drop dash like this. Like, just drop dashing back and forth, back and forth like that to time travel basically anywhere, but again, I am too paranoid of losing my charge to try that out anywhere. Zero LF said, Seems like it would be easier for Eggman to asterisk not spawn air bubbles and just let Sonic drown. Like here, let's try it. Well, if I hadn't hit the ramp, yeah, you could just, I could have just charged a, a time travel right here. Huh. So yeah, I guess it is pretty useful. <laughs> is there a past post down there? Doesn't look like it. There is here though. Um Sure, let's risk it. And there was the generator. Slow down, back up. Oh no! Mother! Hanging out to scrounge up some rings, I guess. I always really like the song. That kind of discordant whistling, it's really cool. He says moments before time traveling. KDV underscore Gronola underscore bars said. That P on the coin counter looks so awful lol. Yep, that's one of the hundred different mods they have for the PC version of this game already is to fix all the lives icons and restore all the music and... Like, I might be pretty happy with Sonic Origins the way it is, but there's no denying that like, man, this could have been a thousand times better. Yeah, okay. <laughs> Drop dash makes time travel easier. KDV underscore Gronola underscore bars said, What is it with this in colors ultimate replacing the live system with something that unambiguously looks uglier on the HUD? I don't know. Like, you could have just kept the lives icon, really. Like, do a thing where, like, after every session, you convert lives into coins. I don't know. Oh, this is a good song, too.
Nine viewers during a GDQ. That's that's pretty impressive. Golden JLR said, "Hey, hey." Ah, yes, the pyramid in the pink water. I remember this one. Please just fly into me. That's all I ask. Don't make Sonic get his nice shoes wet. He doesn't like that. Do you know what water does to leather? It destroys it. Leather is quite literally dried skin, so if you get it wet, it just turns back into skin. Said, Sonic doesn't want to tip his toes in that blade. Yeah. I mean, you know, your feet get all sticky. It's just, it's, it's awful. I mean, have you ever had, like, sticky toes? It's like the worst feeling in the world. Saturn Thew Zero LF said, I'm glad to finally have these remasters on consoles and PC, but I don't know if Origins as a package is worth $40. Yeah. I got mine for $34.99, I think? Because I don't know if it still is, but it was on sale on Fanatical. And like I said in my video, you know, this thing's going to be $20 by Christmas. You know, I think Setsune said last stream... LR said... What mods are you using? It's so funny to ask this for a game that is less than a week old. Zoom Fondil said, It is still on discount on Fanatical. Animated AF said, Yeah, I am waiting for about 20 pounds. She said last stream that they should have upscaled the special stages so they were like high resolution. And for that one in particular, I think I agree because it was, it was a lot of like jaggies and strobing. And for your question on what mods I'm using, I'm not using any mods. I'm not going to mess with mods until after I finish story mode. Saturn Thew Zero LF said, I'd totally be willing to drop that on maybe a physical version. KDV underscore Gronola underscore bars said, you can do that on the decomp, I think. Hmm. Okay, well, we have an awful lot of road here, so I'm just going to... Uh oh. That doesn't work. Hopefully there's another one around here. Actually, you know what? We're close enough to the start of the stage. I'm just restarting. Because with them giving me one right here, you would think this might be the only one in the entire level. Yeah, I'd pay full rack if it was physical. Please. Zoom Fondil said, What is Sonic's favorite CD? Uh, I don't know. I don't have a clever, witty answer for that. Because, like, I'm, I'm a total, like, in-the-dark music guy. I don't listen to popular music. I listen to video game music. You figure he probably listened to something poppy, rocky, you know. Space Ghosts musical barbecue. You know that if you really <laughs> He loves Brax Don't Touch Me song. Bloops said, What's your favorite obscure game soundtrack? Hmm. Would it be obscure to say the Jurassic Park Super, Super Nintendo game? Because 
that like that soundtrack is honestly a banger and it's kind of like it's a I don't want to call it shovelware because I did a whole video on how I really like that game but Sonic CD is quite the ironic name for a game in a world where physical media is slowly dying more and more with every passing year I need to pay more attention to the game I'm I just I spaced out a second trying to picture animated AI music said <laughs> Sonic the comic stated that Sonic's favorite TV shows were Ren and Stimpy and Beavis and Butthead <laughs> Man, the thought of Sonic the Hedgehog laughing his ass off at Beavis and Butthead in particular is a great visual. <laughs> Recently I watched the, the brand new, the second Beavis and Butthead movie. Beavis and Butthead do the universe, and that's a pretty good movie. Like, I was never really a big fan of the TV show, but the two movies, Do America and Do the Universe, are good. Said. I'm surprised that you aren't using the mod that removed the blur filter. Actually, I'm not sure if it's a filter, just a weird resolution. Animated AF. I think it's a shader. As a kid, I was like, hey, Sonic is just like me. <laughs> Wait a minute. Why is this already smashed? Do I already have all the time stones? I must already have all the time stones. Saturn Thew Zero LF said, Yeah, Sonic got them all. Can so the pink water one was all of them? Said, Yes, that last one you got was the final time stone. Huh. The underscore Gronola underscore bars said, The game renders at 424 by 240, so the blur is just the game upscaling it really badly. KDV underscore Gronola underscore bars said, Yeah, pink water is time stone seven. Animated AF said, Miss the good or future run darn. See, for me, it was always the stage right before the pink water that I had so much trouble with. I always remembered that one being the final time stone. Well, that's good. We don't have to worry about anything going forward. KDV underscore Gronola underscore bars said, Yeah, I tend to notice that six is generally harder than seven in most Sonic games, including this one. Also in Parappa the Rapper, the stage right before the final stage is always harder than the final level itself. Gosh, this is such a weird boss. It'd be funny if you could drop dash to make this go faster. Said, yeah, that was the last one. I did the same mistake when I was playing yesterday. Whoops. I was taking a drink. figured I could just skim it with one hand instead of needing to jump. Winner, winner, chicken dinner. Thank you. AF said, Robotnik is SIRL right now. Hmm. Golden JLR said i like this boss it uses sonic speed in a clever way kdv underscore <sighs> underscore bars said i think the reason you remember six is the last one is this game still takes you to the next one even if you failed your prior attempt so you were maybe failing six and then beating seven so your next try on six was the final time stone yep probably so it's a good thing we already have all the time stones, so I don't have to screw around exploring this level. Because I know for a fact... Said, My uncle works for Sonic CD and says if you achieve a good future, then Knuckles Chaotix manages to be a well-made game. <laughs> Boy, if only that was true. Act 2 of this contains a robot generator location that is the sort of thing where, like, if you run past it, 
you can't go back and get it after the fact. You have to know where it is on your first run and get it before you pass it. But since we have all the time stones, it doesn't matter. But this is by far the worst level in this entire game. The worst zone. Because Act 2 isn't any better. Zoom Fondel said, The Knights Templar 2, Wacky Work Bench Zone. Please. And Somebody AF said, At least the floor makes a dope noise. Yeah. But it's like somebody, like a level designer said, hey, what if we made the most annoying level possible? Where the player doesn't have any control over themselves anymore, and they're constantly fighting to go where they want, but they just can't. And that's the whole level. Is being out of control for two and a half minutes. Golden JLR said, I hate the Act 1 generator. You need to get crushed. <laughs> it's not a good secret. Okay, I guess that counted as a place to time travel. I just was Saturday marveling at the funny sound. Said, Sonic CD level design feels like somebody just dumped a big bowl of spaghetti all over the floor and tried to arrange the noodles and meatballs into shapes. Animated AF <laughs> said, Wow. Dun 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 dun. dun. see, I think, if I remember right, the robot gener generator right now is under us. So, you have to, like, backtrack this way. JLR said, I love how Mania used this same floor gimmick and made it good. And, like, you have to go all the way up this, but you have to time travel before you come here. So you have to figure out some place to time travel before you get locked off and can't come back here. It is disgusting. Well, now I'm now I'm trapped in here. But I think the robot generator is down there somewhere. Now we're in Stick Canyon from Nights into Dreams. KDV underscore Granola underscore bars. Right. You just went past it. It was right next to that past post. Yep. So you have to go down there, climb up, it gives you the past post, and you have to go down there and climb up again. This game sucks. <laughs> like, I shouldn't say it sucks because the music is awesome, the art direction is awesome, but... The act of playing it can be such a bummer sometimes. Granola underscore bars said, either that or you can jump over the speed booster. Which I tried to do. KDV underscore Granola underscore bars said, oh, you just described my thoughts on Black Knight Way T. <laughs> Yeah, Sonic the Black Knight is a very pretty game. Saturn Fuse Zero LF. But it's not a very fun game. Sonic CD and Knuckles Chaotix are the same in that they're great until you're asked to play them. Yep, and ironically enough, Knuckles Chaotix has people from the Sonic CD development team on it. People who, like, very explicitly only worked on Sonic CD and never graduated to join Sonic Team proper. Zoom Fondel said, Those sons of bitches. Hey, wait a minute. Penguins aren't supposed to fly. What's that about? Animated AF said, makes y'all think. It's weird how the past is like this desert construction area. And in the future, this is like a carnival? Said, maybe they can in the future.
Animated AF. This is a really tricky boss. Because you can get crushed by those really easily. And you can touch that. Okay, now I think you stand here. Right? Yes. Now, my strategy used to be to try and jump over the pit. Whoops. Like that. But that gets to be kind of tricky on this last step. Granola underscore bars. Right? This boss is so weird to me. It looks like it was designed around a 16 to 9 display, even though there's no way that could be true. Yeah, I know. Fighting hippo said, who this boss, though? I like the way the steam looks when it comes out of his machine. They animated that, that effect really well. Oh, I just realized I never posted about this in my own Discord. Whoops. Not used to... Did they change the sound on those? They did, didn't they? V underscore granola underscore bars. Yeah. This game has really good animations. The new ledge teetering animations are much better than their Sonic 2 equivalents. Golden JLR. Did they changed that sound. I love Nato Oshimark, but have you ever noticed that this game, the one that he directed, and the games made by his company have really bad design? Yes. Guiding hippo. I have definitely noticed that. Just got here. Did you get all the lit time stones or are you going for machine destructions? I was going for both, and then I got all the time stones without paying attention. WTF, that's a completely different and worse sound. Why? I don't think it's a completely different sound, but I have a feeling that the original sound was like two different sounds mixed together, maybe. I mean, I don't think that's really possible on the Genesis. But it sounds like it's part of the original sound, but it's missing something. <laughs> yeah, the song. Okay, I need to stop getting stuck in that. I need to, like, actually progress forward. But yes, I have all the time stones. We were in Quartz Quadrant Act 2, Katie. and suddenly I went, why do I have the robot generator already? The original sound is the one that played in that spring launcher just now. <laughs> yeah, that's weird. So Sonic Team will revert the cha- said, ha hey hey, ha 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 hey hey. Sonic Team will revert the changes the Retro Engine versions made but then they'll make their own random arbitrary changes to things? That's a little weird. KDV underscore Gronola underscore bars said, This is just like forces with the wrong stomp sound. I mean, don't even get started. Like, so many Sonic games have the wrong sounds for so many things. Like, the spin dash sound in Sonic 4, which was a problem in Sonic Generations, which was the problem in Sonic Lost World. They've been getting these sounds wrong so much. Bars said, oh God. Yeah. KDB underscore Gronola underscore bars said, I can't believe nobody made a mod to fix the spin dash sounds in Sonic 4, yet it would be really, really easy. Dieting Hippo said, Stealth was talking about how they made changes to S3 and K after they submitted their build. I assume they did extra changes to the other ports when putting them in. Well, the way Stealth just made it sound, it sounded like a side effect of importing them. Nobody cares enough to mod it all. <laughs> yeah, I know. Dario actually started a Sonic 4 Episode 2 mod, 
to add in Classic Sonic from Generations, and he never even finished it. The animations and some cutscenes are all messed up. And he was just like, eh, nobody cares, and he never finished it. <laughs> oh, I love this song. No, go back the other way. No more Eggman face. AF said, Oh yeah, I tried that mod Sonic would be all mangled in the cutscenes, haha. Yep. And in some of like the special stages too. KDB underscore Gronola underscore bars said, I made a modern sounds mod for episode two earlier this month and it has zero interactions because nobody <laughs> ever uses the Sonic 4 game banana page. Yep. That sounds about right. Zoom Fondel said, I've said it before, but seek out Osric Tentacles. It's like endless albums of US Sonic CD music. Golden JLR said, Speaking of sound effect, isn't the sound director of Sonic 1 still on Sonic Team and he is the person to the most credits in the franchise? Uh, I'd have to double check that. Because that does not sound familiar to me. Zoom Fondel said, okay. It is actually Sonic the Hedgehog himself. That's true. Sonic Maurice Takeshi Ogalive the Hedgehog. Somebody out there just cringed themselves to death hearing that. <laughs> and it was me. KDB underscore Gronola underscore bars said. Oh, they made a change to the 2011 version that I really dislike. Bloops said, It's weird that a lot of the bosses feel so hollow in this game, not necessarily poorly designed. Some are even really interesting, unique with a clever concept, but very rarely does that translate through to it. Oh, here's the end. Okay. Text to speech randomly assigns a voice and a. Not a voice. Like, you all have the same lady voice, but. It randomly assigns. Metal Sonic more like Garbage Sonic pitch and rate of speaking so sometimes people sound really depressed sometimes they sound really hyperactive <laughs> and that's just the way it is <laughs> whatever you are born with you are stuck with <laughs> oh hang on the ps4 will enter rest mode in 10 minutes there had to push a button. Saturn Fuse Zero LF said, Sometimes I dream about cheese. Get out of here, Gordon Froman. Gloops said, I don't mind sounding depressed. I just feel like a nuisance to everybody here with how slow my messages are LMAO. <laughs> Well, 148 said, just popped in still iffy about CD as a whole. Yeah, I'm still not super happy with Sonic CD. Concerned. I don't hate it. It's fine. You know, there are there are worse Sonic games, but there are still a lot of things in this game that I do not agree with. Buggy bumpers. Anyway, your bloops, your voice sounds fine. Like. There are some voices that come through on the TTS that make me burst out laughing because they sound so ridiculous. Go watch my Sonic Robo Blast 2 stream, I think. Or Balan Wonder World. It's on my YouTube channel. 
Might even still be on Twitch. Saturn Thew Zero LF said, Rubbery Ducky, you're the one. You make bath time fun. Let's go down the tube. I don't remember where this goes. Now see, people like to say, well, Sonic Advance loves to spring you into spikes. Well, what is this? Sonic CD invented that. And like this one is like fairly innocuous. Like you can see it right there. There are ones later in this level where you cannot see the spikes. And they just launch you into them. LR said, "You Fumi Makino Maki on Sonic One credit worked on the majority of Sonic games, and he was credited in pretty much all of that were made by Sonic Team as sound producer." Huh. Golden JLR said, "From Sonic One to Forces." Wow. I don't remember what that did. KDV underscore Gronola underscore bars said, Oh yeah, didn't he compose the drowning theme? Oh yeah. Golden JLR said, Yes. So he's like a legitimate legend. And then this weird thing. That you have to use to progress forward. KDV underscore Gronola underscore bars. <coughs> they should me. have gotten him to do the new Sonic 3 stuff for Origins and not to know. Yeah. KDV underscore Gronola underscore bars said, John Sino was never sound programmer. Like, in general, I think the Sonic community is too harsh on a lot of members of Sonic Team. But that was really a screw-up. Like, that explains so much of what's wrong with Sonic 4, the soundtrack anyway. And what was wrong with the new tracks in this game. It's, oh, like, it's like, oh yeah, this guy, like, there's a step missing, right? They needed a sound programmer to come in and translate his music, and they didn't. They didn't have that. And, like, that's more of a management issue than it is Jun's problem or Sonic Team's problem or anything like that. Like, the producer or someone else should have known better. Said, He's not like Yuzo Koshiro who has a whole setup to convert music into the hardware he works with. Right. I mean... Dude, just get Yuzo Koshiro to do music for this. He's done Sonic music in the past. See, that's what I'm talking about right there. Those spikes right there. From all the way down here, you can't see them, but it will spring you right up into them. Because Sonic CD hates you. Ronola underscore bars said... Yeah, Sega is plagued with management problems and has been for a long time, I think. No surprises there. I mean... said they should get dreams come true to come back. You could say that Sega's been plagued with management problems since the 90s. And there's no way they could get dreams come true to come back. Like, they are like mega stars in Japan. They should get Akon to do the backing of another Sonic Zone. <laughs> Sky Sanctuary Zone where he's just back there going, Ugh! Yeah! Let's go! One more time! Does he say one more time? I don't know. KDV underscore Gronola underscore bars said, Hot take, I genuinely like that song. I mean, it's fine. Zero LF. It's just kind of ridiculous. Honestly, same. But also, that was probably a good song before Akon touched it, because it's just the Sonic 2 credits music. You know? It's... it's Oh, this part. Oh, no. That's a bottomless pit down there. I think we just have to time this, right? Oh, 
I don't know. I don't remember. I just know that that's a bottomless pit below me. Saturn Fuse Zero LF said, maybe the real bottomless pit was the friends we made along the way. I don't know. Sonic seems pretty lonely in this game. Uh, please. Mm, there we go. In this weird part. And this weird part. Hey, look at this idea for a boss we didn't have anywhere else to put. Bars said, I think a better addition to this game would have been the Insta Shield. KDB and yeah, maybe. Ronola underscore bars said, for parts like THSI. It's kind of a crummy final boss. I like that they put bumpers on the side to keep it 4x3. Let's just take the hit. Speed things up a little bit. Another blog said, I was going to get every robot generator in CD very recently, but then I got all the time stones. Yeah, I couldn't hit the very last one. Surprisingly, I didn't mind searching for them in spots to time travel. Just very difficult. Time limit sucks, though. Dieting Hippo said, the Sonic 2 Force Fields. What a dork 148. Huh? That's just Sonic CD, and there's this part. This game in a nutshell. Saturn Fuse Zero LF said. Do the pogo stick. They let no. me actually go forward with that final fever boss and that desert dazzle level. What a dork. I don't know. Said. Weird part. Golden JLR said. Looking at Sonic 1 credits, I think Yuka Fumi, Makino, and Rico Kodama are the only ones left at stated, but Makino is the only working at Sonic Team. After Sonic Mania and how slow all those bosses were, I don't know if I'd want them to do a new boss fight for Sonic CD, yeah. though it would fit the theme, you know? How the hell is that the final boss? Yeah, it's kind of a lame final boss. Ooh, big stretch. What time is it? I should be wrapping up here soon. People are going to be getting home. KDB underscore Gronola underscore bars said, The yes, final boss music doesn't do any favors either. Literally just the normal boss music with different mixing. Big Island said, this entire game was Eggman half assing it. It's not a numbered title, who cares what I do? These little animations are so cool. Even now. We really needed a whole Sonic the Hedgehog animated movie that looked like this. Tyson Hess does good job, but still, this is still superior. Got that classic 90s anime look. And like this part, oh my gosh. So sad how rare that can get. Saturn Fuse Zero LF said, it's a crime that the OVA didn't become a full series. Golden JLR said, I think they added the mini boss before the final boss because because of this animation. Animated AF said, peak Sonic animation for sure. I feel like they kind of messed up that animation a little bit though. Sonic is supposed to do the pose after he blows up Eggman for a little bit longer than he did. There's supposed to be a longer fade out at Stardust Speedway there. That's small things. It's not a big deal. What a dork 148 said. Tyson has classic Sonic and 90s Sega Sonic. Classic Sonic is a much different vibe. Yep. KDB underscore Gronola underscore bars said. Hey, I wouldn't say peak. Unleashed opening is still a big contender, but it is very nicely stylized. Animated AF 
said. It was running too fast acting. You know, a little too fast. Said. Yeah, the ending is at half the speed in the original. Go Game Team? Is that who did the the new retro engine updates? AF. Said. Unleashed was great too, but I have a 2D bias. Thank you for playing. All right, it says, yeah, that was a little too fast too. It's supposed to loop over that text. KDV underscore Granola underscore bars said, I definitely understand that. Dieting Hippo said, I just have this. That's cute. Now, why did you have to include that? Like, obviously, we're going to see him in like 10 seconds. Said, I get why it's being done, but it's still weird to see the jump from 16 to 9 cutscenes to the original 4 to 3 and back to 16 to 9 again. KDB underscore Gronola underscore. Rough and tumble over here. Said, ah. Saturn Pew Zero LF said, It's officially canon, Tails Patrol. I mean, that was always his backstory. I mean, he even mentions that in the Sonic movie, right? So we'll play for a couple more minutes here, but like I said, I have little boys getting home soon, and they are very loud and very rowdy. I'd rather not have them, like, distracting anything by getting picked up on the microphone or anything like that. So we'll play to like maybe chemical plant. Score bars. Said. Oh, it's just like that, huh? No title screen or anything. Yeah, no, that's the way story mode goes. You just you watch the cutscene and you're in. I don't like the way the ring sound is cutting itself off when I collect more. Now do you hear tails? This is a bug people are complaining about. He's stuck somewhere off screen and he can't get to me. I've heard there's a fix for this. When he's doing this, hold up on the D-pad and force him to fly. Zoom Fondil said, Tails is trying his hardest. Okay. Dieting Hippo said, Ooh yeah, ring collection sounds weird. It's because the ring collection sound is a, a wave file or whatever. And it's cutting itself off every time it plays the next sound. Said, Coincidentally, that ring sound thing is actually a problem in the Sega CD version of Sonic CD. Hmm. Oh, look at this. KDV underscore Gronola underscore bars said, I just learned this yesterday when messing with Blast M. KDV underscore Gronola underscore bars said, the nightly builds have Sega CD and Master System support and stuff. Oh, nice. Animated AF. I need to check that out. Glad Sonic Team didn't try to undo this. Yeah, I know. I should see if the classic version, classic mode, uses these polygonal special stages or the originals. Well, this looks so good. I forgot how bad it originally looked when I was playing through as Vector the other week. Yeah, something about the stereo separation on these rings is bugging me. KDV underscore Gronola underscore bars said, Right now there's a bug where it crashes when you try to rebind your controls, but it's pretty easy to just manually edit the defaults config file, or you may not even have to mess with it if you already have an older version on your computer. It saves stuff in app data. Yep. I already have an older version. 
Yeah, this ring sound thing is bugging the hell out of me. Another thing I'm glad they didn't revert, the retro engine versions of Sonic 2 make it so that you keep your rings when you come out of a special stage. That's not true in the original Sonic 2. In the original Sonic 2, when you come out of a special stage, it resets you to zero. But it makes it way easier to do things like this. Golden JLR said, that was the case for the VO2 of Sonic 2, the Knuckles in Sonic 2 and Sonic Jam. Hmm. Animated AF said, unless playing as Knuckles, if I recall. Yeah, I haven't done a run of Knuckles in Sonic 2 in a very long time. KDV underscore Gronola underscore bars said the knuckles in Sonic 2 special stage sprites look so weird. Did they fix him in this version? Because in the original version he had tan arms. Said his arms are tan for some reason. <laughs> yeah. Because they just replaced the head and they left the arms from the Sonic sprite. Like it's his head from Blue Spheres and it's the. Katie body and arms from Sonic 2. Bars said, I don't have Origins, yeah, I couldn't tell you. Well, I mean, I've had the mobile versions too, and I don't remember. Said, wow, I never noticed that. I think they might have fixed it in the Retro Engine version, I don't remember. Granola underscore Bars said, I don't remember either, lol. Golden JLR said, it's fixed on mobile. KDB underscore Gronola underscore bars said the only recent playthroughs of none of this were the decomp and I just played as Sonic. Yeah. And like I usually play as Sonic alone because I can't stand having Tails in the special stages because he screws me up a lot. But since we're in story mode, we have to have Tails. Said me too. Zoom Fondel <laughs> said, just use Nux old sprites from SRP to emo SMDH. Mm -hmm. Hey, wait a minute, that's not fair. Sometimes you come out of that alcove there and you hit the spikes. That's happened to me before. Said, Coconuts, Golden JLR, said, Sonic Jam Sonic 2 is based on Nux in Sonic 2, including bug fix and rings requirement. Nice. Ha! <laughs> I don't want to lose my rings because I want this panel up here, this checkpoint. Man, Sonic 2 loves slap bass so much. Animated AF said, I probably played Sonic Jam more than the MD versions as a kid in total. It's hard for me to estimate that. I played a lot of Sonic 3 on my Genesis. But I also played a lot of Sonic Jam. Animated AF said, Despite the slowdown and slightly wonky music. Mm hmm. Yeah, for years I thought maybe there was just something wrong with my Saturn. Ronola underscore bars said. Okay, gotta be quiet. Said what? The TTS died on that line. With a wee -law. Oh, there we go. Dieting hippo said. I played so much of Sonic 3 and SNK separately, lol. 
Katie B underscore Granola underscore Bars said, I had Sonic 1 and 3 on Virtual Console but not Sonic and Knuckles or Sonic 2. Anyway, what I was trying to say is that for years, I thought there was something wrong with my Saturn because it would have tiny bits of slowdown in those games where the Genesis versions didn't. And it was only very recently that I learned that, no, that's just what happens in Sonic Jam. It just has random slowdown in places. Animated AF said, though I did probably put hundreds of hours into Sonic 3 debug mode on MD. Thanks, Tails. KDB underscore Gronola underscore bars said, I do own real Genesis cartridges of everything now, which is really cool. I kind of want a Sega CD, but I would literally only use it for one game, so it's not worth it to me. KDB underscore I only have my Sonic 2 cartridge. Said, That's the same reason I'm not too worried about getting a Dreamcast. What a dork 148 said, for the longest time, I thought 8-bit Sonic 1 and 2 were the odd games. This is what, 4? I found out about the 16-bit games. We what might games? actually have all the Chaos Emeralds by Chemical Plant Zone. <laughs> Maybe I need to slow down. <laughs> he said playing a Sonic game. I'm sure I'm going to lose a couple of these here soon, though. KDB underscore Gronola underscore bars said, That is definitely possible. I could never do it though. I would always fail at least once. But also, we have coins to retry ones that I fail. Okay, it's this. I hate this part. Because they pull stuff like that. Oh, you should have been on the inside track. Granola underscore bars said, And most of my time with Sonic 2 is this version, since I never had it on Virtual Console or anything. <laughs> what a dork 148 said, Wanna slow down in a Sonic game? Play Lost World. Another blog said, I'm sure you could infinitely retry without huh? spending coins by restarting the app. Yeah, probably. But that takes so long. Another blog said, unless they changed that. They might have changed it. I don't know. Get down. Da, 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 da. Golden JLR said, you can't restart from the menu in this version. Another blob said, I see. No, we're not going to get all seven. We might get seven by Chemical Plant. I think I'm alone in these being my favorite of the special stages. They're probably my favorite, but that's only because I got sick of Blue Spheres. Between Sonic 3 Knuckles and Sonic Mania, I am burned out on Blue Spheres. Dieting Hippo said, The secret strat is to keep starting the game through the secret stage. Animated AF said, Same. Yeah, we're not gonna finish this one. Just barely. What a dork 148 said. I'm in the minority that don't really like most special stages. I mean, they're not like usually fantastic or anything, but as a little distraction between the platforming, they're pretty good. They're good as a mini game, not as a full game. 
and Sonic Mania tried to treat them kind of like they were a full game. Animated AF said, I quite like the Chaotix ones. Yeah, they're all right. A little buggy, though. Oh, that's the one I always miss. Said, I'm in the minority for this special stage. I love having Tails. Got so good <sighs> to grab more rings because he's offset. Holy crap! 200 on the nose! The special stages in Sonic Schoolhouse where you help Sonic do his taxes was really pushing it. Yeah, I know. Winner, winner, chicken dinner. There wasn't even any TurboTax back then. And you know Sonic uses TurboTax. <laughs> yeah, that was pretty close. <laughs> Like, that's normally the one that I always fail, because I, I don't get enough rings. Because I miss that one section in the sky there at the start. Or, like, the... Don't get too excited, boys! Those were the easy one! Excess is Mania's biggest issue, granted. That was really loud. Dieting Hippo said, You got two checkpoints for that on the dot. Golden JLR. These sounds sound more compressed to me. Kid, like every average Brazilian, I just want a Master System collection, and I'm not even talk about Sonic remakes or something. Just give me an emulated collection, how Mega Drive one on Steam. Yeah, I know, they need to treat those games a little bit better. They can be pretty fun. Said, I think the S2 special stages are mapped in my brain thanks to Versus Mode. Oh, come on. KDV underscore Gronola underscore bars said, I don't remember where I read heard this, but the 3DS version of Generations was a big missed opportunity to use all handheld levels. Mm -hmm. Animated AF said, me and my sis played VS mode every week for like two years. Golden JLR said, I'm not talking just about Sonic. Golden Axe Warrior is expensive. KDB underscore Gronola underscore bars said, So Master System, Game Gear, GBA, DS. What a dork 140. I'm trying to take it slow. Said, Cause I know there's a checkpoint around here. Chunk of the 8-bit games, I didn't grew up with those before the 16-bit ones. Dieting Hippo said, Big ups to 3DS generations for having big arms. <laughs> big ups for big arms. Can I get some big arms in the chat? Was there just no checkpoint in this act at all? Cause we're at the end. KDV underscore Gronola underscore bars said, yeah, Chemical Plant Act 1 makes it really easy to accidentally miss any checkpoints. Yeah, which is exactly what I did. KDV underscore Gronola underscore bars said, the main route for Act 1 has no checkpoints on it. I heard Tails die somewhere. Trying to get Tails unstuck. Okay, I know there's a checkpoint around here somewhere. Golden JLR said, it's so funny how Sonic 2 hides checkpoints. I mean, I don't feel like they normally do, but they definitely do in Chemical Plant. There it is. We have to sacrifice the upper route for it, though. So this is six? Yes, because seven is like gray and yellow, I think. Dieting Hippo said, Yep, six. I 
I used to be really terrible at these, but I've started getting pretty good. It used to be the only Sonic game I could get all the Chaos Emeralds in was Sonic 3 and Knuckles. And then at some point in the last, I don't know, four or five years, I started doing all the Chaos Emeralds in Sonic 2. I used to just only use a cheat code to give me all the emeralds. Golden JLR said, Did they change the colors of the emeralds to be consistent between games? I don't know. Ding dong. I find hanging out in a corner like that Dieting hippo. helps a lot. Staying right here. I could always do, but always had rotten luck finding big rings in three. See, Sonic 3 was the game that started making me read game magazines, so I had like all of Sonic 3 memorized before I'd ever even played the game. Because I just memorized the strategy guide that they printed in GamePro. So if you want to know where a big ring in Sonic 3 is, I have a pretty good idea of where that is, because I just have them all memorized even now, you know, 30 years later. When you get to Sonic and Knuckles, I have no idea where any of the big rings are at all, outside of like Mushroom Hill. And a couple in like Sandopolis and Lava Reef. And like, that's it. I don't know where any of the other big ring locations are. So like usually when I play Sonic 3 and Knuckles, I get all the Chaos Emeralds and then I never get any of the Super Emeralds until after I beat the game. No one knows where the big rings are in Sonic and Knuckles. KDB underscore Gronola underscore bars said, you named all three zones that even have big rings in the Sonic and Knuckles have lol. Dieting Hippo said, same Angel Island and Mushroom Hill and that's it and one in Carnival Night. KDB underscore Gronola underscore bars said, never mind, I forgot about flying battery. Shortcut. Let's get that last Chaos Emerald. This one's tricky. And if you've never seen it before, you'll find out why. Dieting Hippo said, let's do it. This isn't the tricky part, by the way. Okay. KDB underscore Gronola underscore bars said, I think you can actually reach the ring cap in that first half. Maybe. What I know is that it is imperative you get as many rings as possible in these first two sections. Because now we get this. Hmm, <laughs> Tails, please. Come down here, please. KDB underscore Gronola underscore bars. Tails. Tails. I forgot there was a second section. Dieting Hippo. There's a third section. LMAO, this part I just spin around on the scattered rings. <sighs> Animated AF said, I always found just running in circles grabs quite a few of the meso rings. Whenever I've done that, I always miss like 90% of them. So I just learned to stay in the corner there. Bars said, 
I thought it was just one and three, two is kind of a retread of the first section. Sonic can now change into Supersonic. Now let's go die to the boss because he'll knock me into a pit. How do I change? There we go. Did they add a new sound there? That was weird. Dieting hippo said, easy. So let's do one more level. Excited <laughs> boys, those were the easy ones. Said, they added an extra spinning segment to both sides there too. Cause I'm having fun and nobody's home yet. That I know of. Dieting hippo. At least the kids aren't home yet. Gotta do it, water brewing. Dieting hippo said, and casino night. Sonic 2 is so good until you get to the like the last four levels, <laughs> and then it kind of turns the crap a little bit. KDB underscore Gronola underscore bars said, oh hey, Sylvania Castle Zone. Tails, come here. Thank you. What a dork 148 said, Sonic is fun most of the time. <laughs> yeah, most of the time. And I will try not to use Super Sonic Spam. Maybe just on the bosses. What's that little blue pixel on the one sprite? There's like a little edge of a blue sprite that's not supposed to be there in like the shadow. KDB underscore Gronola underscore bars said, oh weird that's supposed to be transparent. Dieting Hippo said, Looks like a missed pixel for transparency. Yep. KDB underscore Gronola underscore bars said, maybe they used the wrong background color. I almost wonder if it's like a piece of any aliasing for the title card, because that part would be blue on the title card. Oh, I hate this part. There are flies up there that are going to get me. Oh, hello. I always forget that's there. KDB underscore Gronola underscore bars said, we'll have to watch out for it in casino night. Get chumped. They made all these new supersonic sprites for Sonic 3 and Knuckles, but he still turns into yellow Sonic here. It's so weird to see bosses like that in 16 to 9. And like they changed that boss too. Said, I wonder if this boss changes depending on the resolution like the mobile version. In the mobile version, if you spin dash all the way to the edge of the screen like that, the boss doesn't start until you move far enough away so the platforms can come up. That boss just started instantly the moment I entered the arena. Oh, I didn't pay attention to what the graphics looked like. Oops. KDB underscore Gronola underscore bars said, Oh yeah, the blue is the same as the title card, you're right. Now I feel like they screwed these up. Dieting Hippo there we go. said, The two on the end card was fine. Please let me get, let me gamble. There we go.
Zoom Fondil said, Gambling is immoral. Don't do it, Sonic. Sonic follows his own way. Nobody can tell him what is right or wrong. Bars said, But yeah, I doubt this version even supports arbitrary aspect ratios. They wouldn't need to. Yeah, but they might carry it over from the mobile versions. It might just be something in the code. KDV underscore Gronola underscore bars said, true. Get somebody with one of those crazy KDV NVIDIA ultra wide monitors. Bars said, wouldn't surprise me if it was randomly gone though. Yeah, I know with how much they changed otherwise. Or Gronola. Uh, what? Said, oh, ultra wide would be broken. Most newer phones are ultra wide and some small stuff breaks. Hey. Golden JLR. Hey, wait a minute. There is achievement for getting check post. I hate that. KDB underscore Gronola underscore bars. Said, like the foreground objects in chemical plant. Hey, but. Dieting hippo. Said, what? But, yeah, what? Tails, can you stop that, please? It's very annoying. Okay, I just heard the door close. Somebody's here. So we will finish this act and I will wrap up. Said, I wonder how they broke Tails AI. And the end should be like right here. Okay, and that's going to be the stream for today, folks. I know it's a bit of an abrupt ending, but... Underscore bars said, Oh, hey, Casino Street Zone. It's just, it's time for me to wrap up because it's about to get very loud here. We will hopefully pick up tomorrow. Oh, yeah. Loops said, Take care. Um, and maybe I'll even start the stream earlier tomorrow. I actually woke up pretty early today, but I had things to do. Said, have a good one. So we'll we'll do more of this tomorrow. Said, stay tuned. See you another time. But yeah, thanks for thanks for coming out to the stream, everyone. See you tomorrow, I guess. <laughs> Bye.